we're doing an amazing digital circus build challenge. But I'm secretly gonna be using hack stick troll, my friend. Using the command slash slash paste, I can instantly spawn in this massive pomni. And little does my friend know, I'm gonna fill up the entire thing with traps to troll him. So now, let's go check on my friend Bubbles. And Bubbles, what in the world are you doing? Help me, GE Abstract the Cosmos, keeping me trapped. It's alright, Bubbles, I'll get you out of here. What? But how? Just like this. Ah! Thanks, GE, but what in the world are we doing today? We're gonna be doing an amazing digital circus build challenge. Digital circus? But which character? We're gonna build Pomni. Pomni? That's my favorite Pomni. No, that's my favorite Pomni, but wait a second. What side are you gonna go on? The blue side or the green side? I'm gonna go on the green side. The green side? That's my side. Oh, what the heck? Fine, GE, I'm gonna go on the blue side. It's the better color anyway. I don't know about that, Bubbles, but we only have 10 minutes to build this, so let's get started. Go, go, go. All right, now that Bubbles can't hear me, I'm gonna type in the command. And oh my gosh, our Pomni just spawned in. We're so ahead of Bubbles, but now I'm gonna fill up the entire Pomni with a bunch of traps. Starting with the fake entrance, and hmm, where should I put it? Wait a second, I'm gonna put it right inside of her eye. First, I'm gonna break out a few blocks just like this, and then replace it with this diamond door. Diamond is Bubbles' favorite block, so hopefully this will lure him inside of her trap. Just a few more blocks, and perfect. Now that we built our room, I'm gonna put a fake chest at the end of this wall. Bubbles is gonna think this is his treasure, but before he can get to it, he's gonna fall in my impossible trap. To make her impossible trap, I'm gonna break it a few blocks on the floor just like this. Now we're gonna make a bedrock box. And just to make it a bit faster, I'm gonna fill the entire box with commands. Now that we're done with this box, I'm gonna put down a pressure plate. When Bubbles steps on this pressure plate, it's gonna spawn a ton of deadly mobs. We'll put some dispensers over here, and then fill it up with these mutant skeletons, these magma cubes, and even these ender golems. Now we're gonna connect some redstone to the dispensers, so as soon as we step on this pressure plate, whoa, look at all these mobs. They look super scary. And to make sure Bubbles falls for this trap, I'm gonna make a fake parkour jump. His reaction's gonna be hilarious, so make sure to stick around. But now that we're done with the fake entrance, I'm gonna spy on Bubbles. I secretly put security cameras on the other side of the competition, so let me just open up my camera monitor, and oh my goodness, I can see Bubbles right over there. And just like that, my Pomni build is completed. What do you think of it, little dinosaur? Wait a second, why is Bubbles talking to a dinosaur? He must have gone crazy. Crazy. Wait, why are you running away? What the? But anyways, little does G know, I'm gonna put a whole bunch of traps around my entire build with a secret treasure at the end. And we only have eight minutes left to build, so I gotta hurry up. Wait a second, we only have eight minutes left to build this? I gotta get back to my build. Luckily, my build's way better than his, but I still have to fill this up with a bunch of traps. Moving on to the real entrance, and hmm, where should I put it? Wait a second, I'm gonna put it right over here. I'm gonna break it a few blocks just like this, and then replace it with these ghost blocks. These might look like normal blocks, but you can actually walk right through them. Now that we're inside, I'm gonna start building the first challenge. And this one's gonna be super hard to get through. First, I'm gonna place down some lasers because we're gonna make a deadly tunnel. If Bubbles wants to go to the next section, then he's gonna have to get past all the super dangerous traps that I put in this room. And we're not gonna make it easy for him. Just a few more lasers, and there we go. Now, we're gonna make this room even scarier by putting a ton of lava. I'm gonna break some holes in the floor just like this and then start filling it up. Bubbles is gonna be so mad when he goes through this. Now that all the lava's filled in, I'm gonna add one more thing. I'm gonna add some fans in the ceiling just like this, and then start building an obsidian hole. Now, we're gonna fill the bottom with these diamond spikes, and then cover it up with these ghost blocks. So as soon as I try walking to the exit, look at this. I'm taking so much damage. To actually get out, we'll put a secret door right over here. So now, we can move on to the next section. In this room, we're gonna give Bubbles a super hard decision. Is he gonna press the blue button or the green button? If Bubbles picks the blue button, it's gonna spawn in this Medusa that he's gonna have to fight with only this wooden sword over here. She looks super scary. Let me try fighting her real quick and are you serious right now? I just got turned into stone. There's no way Bubbles is gonna defeat her so make sure to stick around. But if Bubbles picks the green button, it's gonna open up these blocks in the floor to move to the next section. And in this room, we're gonna make a super scary mob battle. First, we'll start by making a metal room and then put some iron bars on the inside. Just a few more blocks and there we go. Behind these bars, we're gonna put a mutant zombie. He looks super scary, so Bubbles definitely needs some items to fight it with. So we'll put all the items he needs in this password chest, and we're gonna make the code 2468. In this chest, we're gonna add a flaming sword, these 
Ender armor, and even some Ron Flesh, his favorite food. If Bubbles wants to open up the chest with all that gear inside, then he's gonna have to find the code hidden in this room. And we're gonna put it in this secret tunnel over here. You might think this doesn't make any sense, but if we take this personal shrinking device inside of my inventory, look at this, I'm super tiny. So if we open up this trap door, we can put the code at the end of this tunnel. But I'm not gonna make it that easy for Bubbles, so I still have to hide this personal shrinking device somewhere in this room. If we put a secret chest right over here, look at that, it blends perfectly with the rest of the ancients. And now we can put the shrinking device right inside. If you want to beat this mutant zombie, then you have to subscribe in 3, 2, 1, let's go! Bubbles definitely isn't figuring this out, but now we can move on to the next section. And this one's gonna be super hard to get through. First, we'll fill the bottom with commands, and then start placing some parkour jumps. We'll put a head hitter over here, and then put a spring at the very bottom, and it's green, my favorite color. This looks pretty good so far, but I want to spice it up a little bit, so if we take these secret items inside of our inventory, we can make some spinning parkour jumps. To make our spinning blocks, we just have to put this piston right here, and then super glue the blocks all together. Just like this. This is coming out perfect. Now, we just have to put this motor at the bottom, and look at this. This looks super cool. I'm gonna keep building this parkour until we get to the end of the course. And while I'm building this, I'm actually curious. Are you Team Pomni or Team Jax? Comment down below if you're Team Pomni or Team Jax, and let's see who wins. But now that we're done with our parkour, I'm gonna try it out. So let me just make this jump over here, and then this jump over there. This is turning out pretty well. I just have to go in these blocks over here. Come on, come on, come on. And are you serious right now? This is way harder than it looks, so I can't wait to see Bubbles' reaction. And speaking of Bubbles, I want to go troll him real quick. If I use this potion of invisibility, I can turn completely invisible. And now I can go over and troll Bubbles. Let me just break in a few blocks in the wall just like this. And whoa, I can see him building over there. Oh yeah, my Pomni build is turning out so good. I'm almost finished. It looks like Bubbles is finishing up his build, but little does he know I'm about to completely troll him. Let me just break out this secret block in the wall like this and whoa, we have these jack spawn eggs. So now I'm gonna fly up to Bubbles and spawn these all over him. All right, now that this leg is done, I'm gonna move on to the other leg. All right, this is perfect. Now's my chance. I'm gonna spawn all of these jacks around him and whoa, look at this. Oh yeah, my build. Wait, uh, uh, what is that? What is that? Wait, are those a bunch of jacks? And they're hurting me. Ow, 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 what the heck? He's noticing it. Get him, jacks, get him. Ah, stop it, stop it. No, oh, I died. All right, this is perfect. Before Bubbles respawns, I'm gonna take this bazooka and bazooka is like over here let's go i gotta hurry and get back and wait what the heck happened over here why is my build destroyed oh no was it you jaxes get over here wait why is he shooting them oh my gosh we only have five minutes left to build i gotta hurry up wait a second we only have five minutes left to build this i gotta get back to my build i had no idea we only had five minutes left but luckily i have the perfect idea for my next trap first we'll make a tunnel with commands and then split the bottom into four sides because we're gonna make a water dropper we'll fill it up with some fake water some obviously fake water some lava and then finally, some fake bedrock. Bubbles is gonna think this bedrock's the wrong answer, but little does he know, I put slime box underneath it the entire time. But to make this chopper a little more difficult, I'm gonna build spikes around the entire thing. We'll place down these diamond spikes, these lava spikes, and even these bedrock spikes. And oh my gosh, this looks super dangerous. Now that we're done with our chopper, we can move on to the next section. And there's no way Bubbles is getting through this one. We're gonna recreate the tent from the amazing digital circus. And in this tent, we're gonna give Bubbles the choice between three doors. The exit door, the blue door, and the green door. Starting with the blue door, we're gonna place down this pressure plate, which will literally teleport us right into Ohio. And wait a second, why is there a bunch of spider pigs in here? Oh gosh, they locked me into the lava. And are you serious right now? That was super scary, but now we're gonna move on to the exit door. We're gonna make a room out of these glitching blocks, and then we'll cover it up with these void blocks. So if we go inside of our exit door, holy grimace, this room looks super glitchy. I have to get out of here. Finally, we have the green door, which is gonna lead to the next section. And we only have one minute left, so I have to be fast. We're gonna give Bubbles a choice between a green treasure and a blue treasure. If Bubbles picks the green treasure, he'll get a ton of secret items. But if he picks the blue treasure, he'll fall straight to his death. Starting with the blue treasure. We're gonna break it a few blocks just like this, and then replace it with these fake blocks. And under these fake blocks, we're gonna put some mines. So if Bubbles tries getting his prize, he's gonna get exploded. Moving on to the green treasure. We're gonna fill it up with some diamond blocks some blue crystals, and even some rotten flesh, his favorite food. And just like that, our Pomni build is completed. So now, we're gonna see whose build is better. Hey, Bubbles. Hey, GE. Now that time's up, whose build are we gonna look at first? Well, in my opinion, since 
since my boat is way better than yours, we should look at mine. I don't know about that, Bubbles, but I guess we can save the best for last. The best for last? Let's look at the best right now. Come look at my Pompney. And wait a second. This actually looks pretty good. But wait a second. Why doesn't she have any legs? What do you mean? Look, they're literally right there. Oh, what are you talking about, Bubbles? She literally doesn't have anything down there. But now that I'm at your build, how do I even get inside this thing? That's a good question, GE. I'll give you a little hint. It's your favorite color. My favorite color? Then that has to be green. But wait a second. Where's the green on this build? Come on. There's got to be some green around here. And aha, there we go. What though? You found that so fast. Even though you found it, the only way you can get inside is by figuring out the password. Figuring out the password? But wait a second. What's a thousand plus a thousand? This is easy peasy. Obviously, the answer is 2,000. So let me just type in 2,000 right over here. And whoa, the door just opened up. And now you can go inside. Let's go. This is easy peasy. I just got to walk over here. And wait a second. What the? Ha, you just fell from my trap. Are you serious? Any bubbles? Are these ghost blocks? Yep, and you just fell in some super explosive landmines. Oh my gosh. Does this mean this is a fake entrance? Yep, and that also means that you're going to have to go find the real one. Oh my gosh. Maybe it's inside of her eye and no. Nope. Or maybe it's on top of her clown hat and oh my goodness. Not even close. Bubbles, I can't find this entrance anywhere. Can you please give me a hint? Hmm, should I give you a hint? I guess I will, but only under one condition. Wait, what's that? Everyone watching the video right now has to like and subscribe. Wait, like and subscribe? Please, guys, I need to find this entrance so everyone like and subscribe in three, two, one, let's go. Now that everyone liked and subscribed, you have to show me the real entrance. Wait, what? How did I do it so fast? Because they're super awesome. What the heck? Fine, G. I'll show you where it is because they liked and subscribed. Let's go. I don't know how you couldn't find it, G, but it's right inside of Pomni's collar. Wait a second. What the? How was I supposed to find this? I don't know, G. E. Not be a noob. Oh my gosh. I am not a noob, Bubbles. And just to prove this, I'm going to get through your first challenge. G, e., to be completely honest with you, I don't think you're getting past my super dangerous lava parkour. Uh, are you serious, Anio Bubbles? This parkour looks easy peasy. I just got to make this jump over here and then another one over there. Come on. What the heck, G? Why are you going so fast? That's not allowed. Ah, are you serious, Anio Bubbles? That's literally cheating. Ah, fine, G. E. You can go through it legit. Let's go. Now I'm totally going to make it. But can you make these ladder jumps? I totally can. Let me just jump on this ladder over here and then hit my head on the ceiling over there. Come on. No way. How are you making it through? And now I'm going to make it to the very end. Let's go. Fine, G. E. I'll give you that. But now you got to climb these ladders and move on to the next obstacle. This better be a real challenge this time. And really, dude, is this actually just a hallway? Yeah, just to reward you for completing that difficult parkour, you can walk through this super safe and definitely not suspicious hallway. Let's go. This is a piece of cake. Let me just walk through right over here. And wait a second. Why is there fireballs? And why is Kinger over here? Ah! Haha, <laughs> you just fell from my trap. This hallway is not safe, Bubble. So I guess I just gotta walk through and make it across. Come on, come on, come on. I gotta be super fast. And wait a second. Is that Zubal? Yep, you just spawned in some Zubal from Digital Circuit. Oh, no. This room is so chaotic, Bubbles. How do we even get past this? Gee, you just got to run through. Wait a second. Did you just put tripwire on the bottom? Uh, maybe. And I think it's getting out of control. Oh, no. I just got to break my way through then. Come on, come on, come on. I got to get rid of all of these tripwire before they attack me. And now I just got to jump over these lasers real quick. Can you make it through? I just got to make this last jump real quick. Come on. And I made it. No way. I can't believe you actually made it through the room. But now that you successfully survived, you can step on these pressure plates to teleport to the next room. All right. So let me just step over here and wait a second. What is this? You're trapped on this one trunk and you're gonna have to mine down correctly with the correct tools to make it to the next room. Mine with the right tools? That sounds super hard. But wait a second. I literally see the exit right over here. Can I just jump down? I mean, GE, if you don't think that's too far of a jump, you can try it out. All right. This looks easy peasy. I'm totally gonna make it. Let's go. Really, dude? <laughs> There's no way you just tried that, GE. That's at least 100 blocks tall. Oh my goodness. I guess you're right, Bubbles. Let me just open up this chest and we have a golden axe, a golden shovel, and a golden pickaxe. Yep, so for the shovel, you're gonna have to mine the dirt, the pick's gonna have to mine the stone, and the axe is gonna mine the wood. Can you do it? I mean, that sounds easy enough. Let me give it a try. So let me just use this shovel over here, the pickaxe over there. Oh no, this is looking pretty hard. Wait, you're actually breezing through this. <laughs> oh no, I just used the wrong tool. Well, because you used the wrong tool, you're gonna get punished by 
silver fish. Ah, what the heck? Haha. <laughs> that was so mean, Bubbles, but that's our extra try too. I'm totally gonna make it this time. Come on, come on, come on. Let's see if you can do it. You're almost at the bottom, GE. Just a little bit more. I almost used the wrong tool for that one. Come on, come on. Only a few more blocks left. And I did it. What the heck, GE? Your reflexes are pretty quick. That was super difficult, but now that I'm finally at the bottom, I can move on to the next section. Let's go. Wee. And wait a second. What the heck is this? Welcome to my go-karting course, where you're gonna have to ride this go-kart all the way around these spikes, lasers, and lava. Your go-karting course? This sounds super scary, but let me just go inside of this car real quick, and whoa. This thing looks super cool. You look like you're playing Mario Kart. I know oh. it. Really, dude? Did my car already break? What the heck, GE? You weren't supposed to run into those spikes. Oh my gosh, that was so unfair. Get wrecked. It's all right, Bubbles. Try to. I'm totally gonna make it this time. Yeah, if you don't run into those spikes again. All right, maybe I can take the wider way around this time. Come on. And oh no, I'm on fire. And look at that. Your go-kart's already breaking. And oh no, I can't drive it anymore. What the? Did you break the engine? I think so, Bubbles. How does this car break so easily? I don't know, GE, but I have a better vehicle for you anyway. And wait a second. What's that? This vehicle costed me a lot of money, GE, so you better be grateful. Really, dude? Is this a couch? Uh, yeah, I guess, but it's not just any couch. It's a rainbow couch. A rainbow couch? Well, I mean, I guess it does have wheels, so let me just go on top of it, and oh my goodness, this thing is so loud, Bubbles. Yeah, and it's super duper fast like a race car. Let me test that, Bubbles. I'm gonna go right through it, and oh my gosh, I just ran into spikes again. I swear, GE, if you break my couch. It's all right, Bubbles. I got this. Let me just make this jump real quick and i made it let's go so let me just walk inside and holy grimace is that a mutant zombie yep he's super duper powerful and you're gonna have to fight him ge wait what but i don't have any weapons that's all right ge i believe in you you're gonna do just fine i'm gonna drop the walls in three two wait wait, wait. No, no 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 hold up wait a minute are you serious right now ge what's wrong i cannot fight this zombie with just my fist there's gotta be some items around here oh my you know what ge fine i hit a bunch of chests around the room with a bunch of items inside that you can use hit a bunch Chess. Hmm, well, I already see this one over here. Let me just open it up real quick. And I got some diamond leggings. Oh, yeah. But can you find the rest of the chests? I totally can. Let me just take a look real quick. There's another chest over here. And I got a diamond helmet. Whoa, GE, you're starting to look really stacked. Yeah, I know. But I definitely need a weapon pretty soon. So I'm gonna look for more chests. There's one over here. And whoa, I got an emerald sword and a diamond chest plate. Yep, I knew you liked emeralds so much. So I had to give you an emerald sword. And now, GE, there's only one more chest left. Can you find it? Hmm, let me just look around real quick. Come on, come on, come on, and aha, there it is. Let's go. Let me just open this up real quick, and I got diamond boots. Oh, yeah. Holy GE, you're looking like a Sigma right now, and it looks like you're ready to fight as well. I'm feeling super ready, mutant zombie. Bring it on. I'm gonna open up the cage in three, two, one, fight. Oh, my gosh. He does so much damage, but I think I can get him. No way, he's destroying you, GE. And oh, no, I just died. Come on, GE, second time's a charm. You got this. I think they say third time's a charm. Really, dude? He just threw me up so high. Yeah, you gotta be careful with his throw attacks, GE. He's super strong. Wait a second. I have an idea. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna let him throw me on top of this pillar. Come on. Just hit me real quick. And there we go. What the? How'd you get all the way up there? Now he can't hit me. This is super funny. And I just killed him. Let's go. But did you really kill him? He's getting back up, GE. Oh, no. Why did he get back up? But what the heck? He's not even hitting you. This isn't fair. Yup, but I just hit him again. Oh my gosh, G, this is cheating. Nope, this is fair and square. Wait a second, why can't I hit him anymore? Oh no. Haha, <laughs> he's out of your range now. I guess I have to jump down again. This is not looking good. Let's see who wins the fight. And I got him. Let's go. This was super hard, Bubbles, but at least he dropped this hammer. Whoa, this hammer is super cool. But now that you defeated the mutant zombie, you can move on to the next room. Let's go. And wait a second, what is this? Welcome to my jetpack course, where you're gonna have to fly through all of these rings like I'm doing right now. Fly through all these rings, but I'm in survival mode. Don't worry, GE. Just jump really high and flap your arms just like me. Wee. All right. So let me just try it real quick. Hiya. Ha. Ah, ah, this is not working, Bubbles. Uh, how in the world do I get past this? Uh, what if I give you a little push? A little push? Wait a second, Bubbles. What are you doing? Uh, don't worry about it. Go fly. Ah. <laughs> Are you serious, Rainio Bubbles? That was not funny. How in the world do I get through these rings? Gee, have you been walking around with your eyes closed or something? There's a chest right over here. Whoa, I don't know why I didn't see that. So let me just open it up real quick. And we got a ton of jetpacks. But wait a second, Bubbles, why are they all diamond jetpacks? Because diamond is the best 
coolest color in the world. Look how cool it looks on me. I guess it looks cool on you, but I am not a fan of the color blue. Do you have any green jetpacks? Yep, I actually have a green one right over here. Take it. Let me see. And ew, this is a diamond jetpack. Get out of here. What the heck, GE? Since you threw that away, you're gonna have to use the blue one now. Oh my gosh, this is so unfair. But I guess I'll just open up this chest and get my jetpack. Good luck getting to the rings. I'll be waiting for you at the end. All right, now that I have my jetpack, I just have to turn it on and whoa, I'm literally flying. I just gotta make it through these rings over here and then over there. Oh no, this is super scary. What the? How are you getting through them so quick? I don't know, Bubbles, but this jetpack's getting out of control. Ah! <laughs> what the heck? Come on, I just gotta get it together and there we go. Now I just have one more ring to get through. Can you make it? I totally can. Let's go. Wow, G, that was really impressive how you got your control back there. But now that you made it through my jetpack course, you're on to the final obstacle. Are you gonna pick the diamond treasure or the emerald treasure? The diamond treasure, the emerald treasure, that's the easiest choice in the world. Obviously, I'm gonna choose the emerald treasure. Let's go. Good choice, G, because there's a whole bunch of emeralds waiting for you. A whole bunch of emeralds? That sounds super exciting. Let me just open it up real quick and... Really, dude? Haha. <laughs> I can't believe that was a trap. Does that mean I have to go in the stinky blue side? What the? Why are you calling the blue side stinky? Let me smell your side. Ew, that's nasty. Wait, what? Let me just smell your side real quick. Ew, this thing stinks. Are you serious right now, GE? Your side literally smells like Ohio. Well, your side literally smells like a sussy imposter, but whatever. I guess I'll go inside of it. Let me just open up this chest real quick and whoa, I got a bunch of emeralds and poisonous potatoes. Yep, that's your price for making it through my build. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Ew, why are you actually eating that? Ah! But GE, now that you've checked out my build, can I please check out yours? Of course, Bubbles. Let's go. When can I turn around? You can turn around in three, two, one, turn around. And what the <laughs> G, how did you build this in 10 minutes? This is way too big. Well, you know me, Bubbles. I'm a building pro. What the? I'm a building pro, not you. Really, dude? I'm the best builder in all of Minecraft. Well, now that I think about it, maybe you are, because this build is absolutely insane. But G, how in the world do I even get inside this thing? I'll give you a hint, Bubbles. It's your favorite block. My favorite block? It's got to be some diamonds. And let me just look around. And ooh la la, I see some diamonds right over there. Good job, Bubbles. You found it. So now we can open up this door and make it inside. Oh, yeah. And I decided to make my room super easy. You just have to get past this parkour and then you can collect your prize. What the GE? That's actually really nice of you. It's only one jump and it's the easiest in the world. I don't even need a running start for this. I'm just going to make this jump just like this. And uh, uh, what is going on? Oh! Get him, mobs. Get him. Help me. What the heck, GE? It literally looks like Ohio down there. Yup, it looks so chaotic because you just went in the fake entrance. Oh, my God. Does that mean I have to go find the real one? Yup, and we better get out of here before. Before we get eaten alive. Go, go, go. Is it in Pomni's button right over here? Nope. Nope. Oh, it's got to be in Pomni's hand right over here. Nah, uh, uh. Gee, I can't find this anywhere. Can you please tell me where it is? Uh, I'm good on that, Bubbles. You're just gonna have to find it yourself. Uh, fine. Are you sure about that, GE? Yo, what the flippity flop. Fine, I guess I'll show you, Bubbles. Let's go. Ah! I don't know who you didn't see it, Bubbles, because it's literally right over here. What the? I literally look right under it. But I guess I'll just walk through these ghost blocks. And look at that, I'm inside. Good job, Bubbles, and welcome to my laser hallway. You're gonna have to get through all these lasers to make it to the next section. Uh, GE, are you sure this is safe? Uh, no, of course it's not safe. That's the whole point. Well, GE, I bet that you made these lasers fake. And oh, what the? Are you crazy, GE? Haha, <laughs> of course they're not fake, silly, but you got this, Bubbles. Let's go. Oh my, I guess I have to jump over this one. Nice. And let me just look down to duck under this one. And look at that, GE, I'm literally making it through. Good job, Bubbles, but can you make it to the end? Let me just play limbo right here and what the heck? Haha. <laughs> How in the world did that laser get me? I guess maybe I'm just too tall. Really, dude? You are not tall, Bubbles. You're like the shortest person of all time. What the? What the last time my mom measured my height? I'm seven feet tall. Seven feet tall? I think she meant seven inches, Bubbles, because you're like microscopical. Oh my. No, I'm not, GE. You're literally the shortest person I know. And see, look, I'm literally too tall. I'm just gonna have to take the damage and go through. Good job, Bubbles. You made it through. And now we can move on to the next section. Sounds good. Let's go. And uh, what's going on? Ow! <laughs> what the heck, GE? This is the real entrance. Isn't it supposed to be safe at the end? It is safe at the end, Bubbles. You just gotta think outside of the box. Let me just look around here closely. Come on, come on. And wait, I think I just found a door. Yup, you just found the hidden door. And now we can move on to the next room. Are you gonna pick the blue button or the green button? Are you serious, right now? Blue is literally the best, most beautiful, most amazing color in the world. Are you sure, Bubbles? I think you mean the most stinkiest and smelliest color in the world. What the? That's some cap. Let me just press this button and... Uh, 
Uh, what in the world is that? Haha, <laughs> you just got turned to stone. G, I can't move. Please help me, help me, G, please. Wait a second, you're still stuck in here? Oh, gosh, I guess I gotta mind you out. Let me take this pickaxe real quick. Come on, come on, come on. What the heck, what the heck? And hiya, there we go. Oh, I can actually move again. Yep, but now that you press the blue button, you have one more choice left, the green button. The green button, ew, I'd rather press the blue button again. Wait, what? You'd rather fight Medusa again? Wait, now that I think about it, I don't want to. I think I'm gonna press the green one. All right. So let's see. And wait, where am I? And uh, gee, what the heck is this? This is a mutant zombie and you're gonna have to fight it. A mutant zombie? Wait a second, G. Did you copy me? Wait a second. What the? Bubbles, did you copy me? What do you mean, what the? It was literally my idea. That's so cat, Bubbles. But you're still gonna need some items to fight the zombie. Yeah, so can you please give me some? Of course, Bubbles. You can find some in this chest over here. Oh, wait. I didn't even see that. Let me just try opening it. And what the heck, bro? It's password protected. Haha, <laughs> I hid the password inside of this tunnel and you're gonna have to find it. Somewhere inside this tunnel. Well, let me just open up this door. Gee, I can't fit. I think I'm way too tall. Yeah, I guess you're a bit too tall for this tunnel, but I hid a secret item inside of this room and if you find it, you can go through. A secret item around this room. Let me just look around. Let me see. And gee, where in the world could this item be other than in this chest? It's camouflaged in this room. Can you find it? Camouflaged? And it's gotta be one of these blocks. And wait a second. Why is this block sticking out like this? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about, Bubbles. Well, I do with my 400 IQ calculations. I'm just gonna write Right click and look at that. I got a personal shrinking device. Good job, Bubbles. Now we can use this device to turn super tiny. Let me just use it real quick and look at that. I'm the same height as you now, GE. Really, dude? What are you talking about? I'm way taller than you. I can literally step on you. Get over here. What the heck? What the heck? Get away. But since you're short, I guess I gotta shrink down too. So let me just use this personal shrinking device and whoa, I'm super tiny. Uh, what do you mean, GE? You literally didn't change. What the grimace? I'm literally still taller than you, but now we can go inside of this tunnel. All right, please don't be a trap. Please don't be a trap. And wait, I see a chest. Nice, but what's inside? Looks like it's the password. 2468. Let's go put it in the chest. Let's go. Let me put in that password real quick. And holy moly. We just got a flame dragon bone sword and some mobzilla armor. And even some of my favorite food, rotten flesh. Good job, Bubbles. And whoa, you look super cool. Yep, and I'll look even cooler when I'm back to normal size. All right, I'm gonna drop the walls in three, two, one, fight. Gee, I'm literally destroying him. Yeah, he's on fire right now and Wait a second. Did you just get him? Did I get him? Oh, no. He's coming back up. What the heck? That's not allowed. Come on, mutant zombie. Get him. And really, dude, did you just fall again? Ha, I think I got him this time. No, uh, uh, not so fast, buddy. He just got back again. And oh, no, I'm dead. Ha, <laughs> ha. Come on, I got this. I just gotta hit him a few more times. Can you beat him? And I think I just beat him. Good job, Bubbles. And this time, I'm gonna try the hammer. Whoa, that's super cool. Yeah, it's like a whole earthquake. Yep, but now that you killed the mutant zombie, we can move on to the the next section. And what the heck is this, G? This is my lava spike parkour, and you're gonna have to go through all of these jumps to make it to the end. Oh no, this looks really difficult with some moving blocks. But I'm just gonna start off with these few easy jumps just like this, and let me get this head hitter. And oh no, I fell. Haha. <laughs> let me make this head hitter. Nice. And now I can bounce on the spring to these moving blocks. Good job, Bubbles, and whoa, you're spinning so fast right now. Yeah, it's making me a little bit dizzy, but I'm gonna make this jump over here, and come on, I did it. And now I can easily make it to the end. Whoa, you did that that's super fast. I guess you really are a parkour pro. Yeah, but my head hurts a little bit from all that spinning. Let's hurry and move on to the next room. Good idea, Bubbles. And for this next challenge, you're gonna have to get through my dropper. Get through your dropper? Well, that should be easy peasy because I already see the water over there. All right, so can you make it? Of course I can. Watch me, GE. Let's go. And wait, why am I dying? Oh, brother, you just got me killed. Yup, because you just fell in the fake water. And wait a second. Ew, why are you holding poop? Uh, 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 what are you talking about, GE? It's yours. Ah, I Get that away from me. You're so crusty, dusty, and musty, Bubbles, but there's still three more sides left, so which one are you gonna go on? Well, let me just look around. It looks like there's another potential water spot. Yeah, but the poop's literally on top of it. Are you sure you wanna go down there? I don't care. I'm gonna do it for the prize. Let's go. Ow! What the heck, GE? That wasn't even water. Yep, it's literally blue wool. I don't know how you fell for that. And wait a second. What is this on my hand? Ew, ew, get it off me. Get it off me. Ah! Ooh, that was really nasty, but let me just look at my last two options. And bedrock and lava. What the heck? Which one are you picking, Bubbles. Wait a second, GE. You're not sneaky. I just thought of something. You must have made that lava fake lava. Wait a second. It's real lava. Hot, hot, hot. There's no way you just fell for that, Bubbles, and now you just have the bedrock. I'm literally gonna break my legs if I jump down on that thing. You just gotta trust me, Bubbles. Come on. Are you sure that's safe, GE? Put it on everything. On Grimace Gritty in Ohio. I promise that's true. Alright, since you put it on that, I'm gonna trust you, GE. 
Hey, let's go. And wait a second. I'm bouncing. Yup, because you made it in the right section. That's super cool, G. And now I can make it to the next room. And wait a second. Am I in the digital circus? Yup, and to get out of the digital circus, you're going to have to choose between the blue door, the exit door, and the green door. Looking at all these doors, the blue one seems the best because it's my favorite color. All right, so can you make it through? Let's see. And oh. Uh, Oh, gee, where, where am I? You're in Ohio and get him, spider pigs. Get him. What the heck? The spider pigs are getting me. <laughs> what the grimace was that, GE? That was super terrifying. You just picked the wrong door, so you made it inside of Ohio. I never want to go back to Ohio again. Can I please pick a different door? Yep, you still have two more left. Let me just smell this green door over here. Ew. All right, GE, I'm definitely not going to be going in that one. This exit door seems much, much better. All right, so can you make it inside? Come on, take me out of this Pomni build. And, oh, gee. GE, what, what is going on? Oh no, Bubbles, I think you're glitching out. You're in the void. Oh no, here, I have an idea. Take some poisonous potatoes. Ew, 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 get those away from me. I'm getting out. Really, dude? Is that really how you get out? Yeah, these are super duper nasty. Are you serious, Rainio? These potatoes are the best food ever, but you still have one more door to go through, so let's go inside. Oh no, do I really have to go through this stinky green door? Yup, do you want your treasure? Wait, treasure? Okay, fine, 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 I'll do it, I'll do it. It. And what the? Why are there two different treasures? This is the most important test of all. Are you going to choose the emerald treasure or the diamond treasure? Well, this is equivalent to asking if I want blue or green. And we already know since I love the color blue, I'm going to choose the diamonds. And wait, what is that? What, what is that? <laughs> There's no way you just fell for that, Bubbles. And now you're going to have to go in the emerald treasure. Okay, fine, GE. I guess I'll go through the emerald side. Let me just open up this chest and wait a second. A bunch of diamonds and rotten flesh? I'm feeling richer than ever. Let's go. Ooh, now that time's up, whose build do you think is better? Well, looking carefully at both of our builds, I think that mine is 50 million times better. Wait, what? Mine was way better. That is not true, but wait a second. Then who wins? I guess we're gonna have to let the comments decide. Everyone comment bubbles. No, everyone comment GE. And if you enjoyed this video, then make sure to hit the subscribe button. And if you want to see another one of GE and I's adventures, then click the video on screen. Bye. Bye. Are you serious right now?